this thing better be good for six minutes long. That's all I'm gonna say. Kendrick Lamar owl hunting. Let's see what he got. Uh. I mean, Drake claims to be Michael Jackson, but Michael Jackson never painted his nails or got his nails done, did he? I mean, there's something sus about him. Okay, off rip. <laughs> Oh shit, yo fuck. Fuck dropping down for that 50, I'll give you 200. I'm too cunning, come touch down the city, let's see who teams want it. You really would be stupid for choosing a rock of jewelry that is foolery. LA goons ready for coonery. Okay. He started like that, in case you didn't know. I'm pretty sure you've seen the other disses, but he, he started like that because Drake used a line in his last diss. The drop and give me 50 line. And I guess that's referring to that's referring to Kendrick's deal <laughs> or something like that or his split that he has with the label. I don't know. But <laughs> Nigga, these size sevens gonna be up in your ass. I'm big stepping cause I'm rapping comp and do it with class. Ain't no gangster in my hood, rocking nails with a pass. Wanna be yachty so bad, you're probably topping for cash. What kind of man tell another man? Oh shit. Oh shit, you wanna be Yachty so bad, you probably top him for cash. <laughs> Damn, okay. Don't make me chip a nail, Kendrick. I'm way bigger than you in Japan. Can't you tell, Kendrick? Only thing that people wanna know is Drake a real killer. Cause those subliminals towards X don't make you real, nigga. You ain't never caught a body. Boy. Oh, okay, okay. I know what that's about. Apparently. Um, and one of Drake's songs, I forget the name, um, he mentioned, he said, he had a line where he flipped uh, XXX Stention's name into like a bar or whatever, because he did XXX. He did three different versions of X or whatever. Anyways, um, uh, people were saying that that was a, a shot at X, saying that basically he the one that got him I don't know. I don't know. That's that's what they're saying. That's what they're saying. I don't know how true it is. But Kendrick said you ain't never caught a body. Towards X don't make you real, nigga. You ain't never caught a body. Boy, you the closest thing to a porta potty. Let niggas piss on you. This industry is more than sloppy. Or these fornications bodies that you caught with poorly shot recording on somebody's watches. Yo, he said he be letting niggas piss on him. What the fuck? No diddy. Oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> oh shit. Body set you caught with poorly shot recording on somebody's watch. And since we're not gonna throw our subliminals, I'll admit it. Your favorite rapper Trizzy been sleeping with Diddy. Listen, I know the tension that's risen. Your what? I just said it. I literally just said it. I literally just said it. Yo, hold on. We gotta go back. What, what the fuck did he just say? Sloppy. Or these fornications bodies that you caught with poorly shot recording on somebody's watch And since we not gonna throw our subliminals, I'll admit it Your favorite rapper Drizzy been sleeping with Diddy Listen, I know the tension that's risen Y'all wonder why he got punched She kept scraping his teeth, he was eating his dick for lunch gotta I go got back. the proof on the US We gotta go back, we gotta go back to the beginning We gotta, we gotta run it back to the beginning We gotta run it back That, what the fuck I literally just said, no Diddy <laughs> Hold on, we gotta run it from the top. Run it for the top, y'all. Claims to be Michael Jackson, but Michael Jackson never painted his nails or got his nails done, did he? I mean, there's something sus about him. Fuck dropping down for that 50, I'll give you 200. I'm too cunning, come touch down the city, let's see who teams want it. You really would be stupid. He said, fuck that drop and give me 50. Give me 200. <laughs> I don't... Oh man, my whole thing is he. I know why he opened like that. It was the bar for, that Drake used in the last disc, the drop and give me fifty or whatever. I guess that's referring to Kendrick's uh, Kendrick split with his label or whatever like that. But I don't know. Correct me if I'm wrong. Let me know in the comments. Stupid for choosing a rock of jewelry that is foolery. LA goons ready for coonery. Nigga, these size sevens gonna be up in your ass. I'm big stepping cause I'm rapping comp and do it with class. Ain't no mm. game. Mm. 
because he did try to come at his uh his little feet. <laughs> he said something about he wearing a size seven, which is odd in itself to know the exact size another man wears. I couldn't tell you what size any of my bros wear because they don't wear my size. So, and even if they did, what relevance would it be? Unless like. Yeah, I don't see any relevance at all. <laughs> I come at him with that weak ass line. Ain't <laughs> my hood, rocking nails for the past. Wanna be yachty so bad, you're probably talking for cash. What kind of man tell another fucking nails for? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm big stepping cause I rap in Compton, do it with class Ain't no gangsta in my hood, rockin' nails for the past Wanna be yachty so bad, you're probably topping for cash What kind Ooh. of man tell another man Don't make me You said you wanna be yachty so bad You wanna be yachty so bad, you probably topping for cash <laughs> No Diddy Oh, well I guess, yeah Diddy, all Diddy implied Nigga, what the fuck <laughs> Oh shit Chip and L, Kendrick, I'm way bigger than you in Japan, can't you tell, Kendrick? Only thing that people want to know is Drake a real killer, cause those subliminals towards X don't make you real, nigga. You ain't never caught a body, boy. Yeah, they said that he was making subliminals in that one song when he flipped the XXX in three different ways or whatever, and trying to say that he's the reason why X got, dude, you don't go somewhere, nigga. You ain't, bruh. And mind you, Mind you, y'all, I'm not even a Kendrick fan. Like, I don't even listen to his music. I used to listen to Drake. I'm going to keep it a buck. And that was the mixtape shit. That was the ransom. That was the all the shit he did with Wayne back in the day. That shit was tough. But after all of that, after the fucking Ghostwriters got involved, and we all know, if y'all don't front like y'all didn't used to listen to Drake, son, just because all this shit happening. Niggas was listening to Drake, bruh. Until that Take Care album. And then it got weird. And we all saw it get weird. And we was like, niggas was like, man, fuck with this shit. This is too soft. I can't do it. <laughs> so I understand why a, a lot of niggas abandoned Drake after the mixtape era. Because once he started making albums, it was, he got soft. I, I can't even say he got soft. Maybe he was soft all along. He was just trying to play the part to get into the rap game. Because <clears throat> nothing about him in Degrassi screamed, I'm a street nigga. <laughs> just, even the character that they tried to get him to play, the kind of bully, tough guy, I'm I'm half black. Like, dude, if you don't, even in the show, it wasn't believable. So how we got here? <laughs> I don't know. It's now that I'm thinking about it, it's crazy how we even got here. Ooh, we. Uh. You're the closest thing to a porta potty. Let niggas piss on you. This industry is more than sloppy. Or these fornications, bodies that you caught with 40 shot recording on somebody's watch. It's hey, my whole thing is. My whole thing is, you letting do. <sighs> You let niggas piss on you. Oh shit. We not gonna throw our subliminals, I'll admit it. Your favorite rapper Trizzy been sleeping with Diddy. Listen, I know the tension has been. I said it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I I knew he was gonna say some shit like that. Yo, I knew he was gonna say some shit like that. Oh we. Listen, y'all wonder why he got punched. He kept scraping his teeth. He was eating his dick for lunch. I got the proof on the USB. What? The tension has risen. Y'all wonder why he got punched. He kept scraping his teeth. He was eating his dick for lunch. I got the proof on the USB. Try me if you want. Apologize like Cole. If I were you, I would stop. I'm never selling myself. The tension has risen. Y'all wonder why he got punched. He kept Yo, I scraping son. his teeth, he was eating his dick for lunch. I got the proof on the USB. Try me if you want. Apologize like Cole. If I were you, I would stop. I'm never selling my soul. Yo, yo, he said apologize like Cole. Cause I ain't gonna repeat all the other stuff. Yo, son. J. Cole did apologize at his festival, at the Dreamville Festival, on the stage. On his stage. <laughs> he apologized to another grown man. Some would say he was being the bigger person. Others would say this is hip hop. This ain't no uh room for nobility. <laughs> this is some dog shit. If you ain't gonna be a dog, don't come here. Don't be here, nigga. 
And I would have to, inc- I would be inclined to agree with the latter. Um, in life, yes, be the bigger person in confrontations if you can. But in rap, nigga, ain't no, no, nigga. A foundation was set years ago. Niggas is just deviating from that with all the weird shit. Like, yeah. So that's why I sold 200k. At least I can say I'm a man at the end of the fucking day. I mean, y'all know what he's saying. He ain't sell half a mil, a mil, two, ten mil, 200k. You know what that means, though. Prince of my first form, bitch. I evolved. I'm sick of this dog. Quit parking before I kick in the door and tell the world a dinosaur yours. It's time for a war. I'm... Mm. Before I kick in the door, yo. Oh, shit. He, he, the nigga said, What'd he say? Kick in the door and tell the world a dinosaur yours is time for a war. I'm honestly bored. You better step up with a weapon. Hurry. I'm about to tell the earth that you're solo like Stephen Curry. I'm worried about you. I knew he was about to say that. Something. I, this, that's crazy. Yo. Yo. And the crazy thing is, in case y'all didn't know, like regular people watching this that's not rappers, that's not really in the game doing the shit, dealing with this or models or, you know, anything in the industry. Yo, a lot of these niggas be fucking each other's bitches. And it is what it is. So, and then niggas be getting them pregnant sometimes and then other niggas be mad. And it's like, I had her first. That's my baby mama. Like, no one cares. Only motherfuckers that care is y'all. I, I, we don't know why. The niggas on the outside who don't care is looking at y'all like y'all goofy. Like, why is niggas fighting over vagina? That technically ain't none of y'all's. That vagina belongs to her. She can do what the fuck she want with it. <laughs> like, nigga, y'all goofy. <laughs> Health to stay away from the pills. Don't worry about my deals. Just worry about my skills, bitch. You ain't no Rihanna, nigga. That's why you still, bitch. Rocky and that pussy ASAP got you still sick. I can't oh, wait shit. For Yo, he said stay off the pills. <laughs> he said stay off the pills. You ain't over Rihanna. That's why you still a bitch. <laughs> oh, shit. No, he is gross. Yo, he is flaming this nigga. Sap got you still sick. I can quit rapping forever and I'll be still rich. Watch you black out on the whip when I hit that kill switch. Yeah, you better have security with you visiting convict Canadian diva. Nice to meet you. I'm eagerly watching to see how many people gon' guard you from these chain snatchers. Get out of line in the trenches and they'll be brain splattered. Fuck Drake. Mm, get, get out of line in the trenches and they be brain splattered. Mm. I'll drop 50 in your PM. 50 back strokes for a million if I DM. This oh, gotta shit. hurt. Ain't below the waist. I'm finna leak the footage. Beat these allegations. I dare you. There's no way to pull it. Yo. 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 Why do niggas got so much footage of y'all niggas doing weird shit, bro? Yo, get the fuck out of here, bro. Why? Why every. Now, now everybody got footage of niggas and shit. Not to say that he don't. I'm not saying this. I'm not saying this because I don't believe him. <laughs> I'm just saying. What the fuck? What? Yo, son. <laughs> and then this is my whole thing. This is why niggas is weird. Kendrick included. Yo, if that's the case, my nigga, who holds on to like shit like that? I don't I don't know the scenarios of where you would come across that information and just sit on it. Like if someone told you, okay, I get that, you like, okay, what the fuck that got to do with me? That's weird. You just log in your head like, hmm, that's weird. Moving on. But you got footage, you know, you got a whole USB drive. <laughs> Niggas took the time to download that and transfer files for you, nigga. What the fuck? Type of cop shit is y'all niggas all. <laughs> type of shit yeah who's volunteering all this information (laughs) 
Yo, son. Yo, son. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, man. This shit is crazy, B. Baited you in this dish, you can't escape from the light. I'm Kobe before the helicopter finna crash out. I'm dropping like 81 troops, I'm finna lash out. Popping mm. bottles of champagne, celebrate. Ooh, recipes of Kobe. See? Oh, man. Because right, you know what it is? Everybody keep trying to dick ride LeBron. Like, oh, LeBron. Oh, oh, he's the greatest of all time. He's the greatest of our generation, of any generation. And da, 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 da. Yeah, tell that to Bill Russell. <laughs> tell that to Larry Bird. <laughs> nigga, tell that to Jordan. Nigga, tell that to motherfucker Kobe. What the fuck you talk about, nigga? 81. What the fuck you talk about, nigga? They said they said that Derrick Rose was gonna stop Kobe. They said they said guess what he did? Guess what Kobe did? He dropped eighty one on that nigga. <laughs> victory. I exposed Drake along with this wicked industry. You're welcome. Sit down and suppose a goat. Now I'm back again. Mm. Better watch your back, cause Diddy might wanna come smack again. Oh, 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 welcome. Oh, Sit down and suppose a goat. Now I'm back Yo, again. Yo, son. Oh. Bottles. See, 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 niggas in the industry out here getting diddied by Diddy and Diddy the Diddler is on the run and shit. And, and niggas is, the Diddler is on the run. This nigga, uh, Meek Mill out here is, is, is having a meltdown. <laughs> Fucking, oh shit. Yo, guess what? You know what that means? It's time for some real motherfucking rap. It's time, for, time for some real niggas, for some real places to come up. Shout out to WNY Records. Shout out to my brother Cobra, man. Big buff shit, no bluff shit. You already know straight from the west side of Buffalo. Like he be saying, you already know, nigga. It's that, that goofy shit is over for that shit. That weird shit came like a, like a whirling, swirling fucking whirlwind of weirdness. And it came, swept niggas up, and now that shit is leaving. And guess who gonna be left behind? The burnt, the tattered, the hurt, and the real niggas who could stick it out all along and stay true to themselves. Shout out to Cat Williams. That's all I'm saying. The champagne celebrating victory. I exposed Drake along with this wicked industry. You're welcome. Mm. Sit down the... Just like Cat Williams. I just said. Okay, we go. Suppose a goat, now I'm back again. Better watch your back, cause Diddy might wanna come smack again. <laughs> No, you need to got everybody. Oh my God. Bam, let's shine. Bam, let's shine. You know it's over your season and we bout that. I keep a poly on me if you want to strike back. You know it's over your season and we bout that. We finna. Bam, let's shine. That's crazy. They don't want to see me win. The way I fucked your mind with this AI, I left my semen in. I'm creeping in this industry quickly. They got to keep me in. Bars heavy gift and my beats are better than leading win. I mean, Lee who is that? Oh, wait, it does say right there. Loza Alexander. Okay. Loza or Laza? Loza Alexander. I don't. I don't know who that is, but he's on a diss. What? That's another thing. Can y'all niggas please, if y'all gonna do a diss record, y'all on some rap beef shit, y'all, that's what y'all wanna do? Yo, stop putting niggas on y'all songs. What the fuck is going on? I didn't like it back in the day when Pac did that shit. What the fuck you got five niggas on a song for? I mean, he said it. He's like, I don't even wanna go at y'all. I'm gonna let my little homies ride on you bitch made ass bad boy bitches. Yo. <laughs> but still, but still. I I don't understand that. You uh, niggas is Don't ask me what I really think of all these niggas cuz niggas ain't going to like my opinion, but it's my opinion. So I'm going to keep it to my motherfucking self about that. I don't know. Leland Wayne, what's his name? Metro Boom and stop the cooning. I'm the teacher now. You niggas been the students. I'm sick and tired of people. Yo, question. Why everybody keep coming at Metro? What the producer do? No, I feel, now that, y'all out, out of bounds. Y'all out of bounds. The producers don't say shit. Ain't no producer done said shit on a track other than his tag since fucking, uh, uh, um, since Diddy. Nigga, don't nobody, oh, well, I guess DJ Khaled. Okay. Well, don't nobody be yelling on the track saying shit about niggas, the two niggas about nothing except DJ Khaled. The fuck did Metro do? This nigga ain't say, I listened to that whole, first of all, I listened to Future Hole. 
him and Future whole mixtape. That shit fire. I don't care what nobody say. That shit tough. It's tough. And again, I'm not even a Kendrick fan, but that fucking, um, that like that joint, it's tough. Tough. And they did it over an old school beat that's been remixed mad times, most famously by Wheezy on the Drought 3 and by uh, um, Slim Thug, a thug from around the way. Nigga. It's tough. So that whole mixtape, that whole, I mean, the whole album was tough. Um, the second one he dropped right after that, it was mid. Mid. But, um, and again, I'm not even a Kendrick fan like that, but the nigga is, these niggas know too much about each other and it's weird. I, I'm looking at all these niggas like they're weird, respectfully. Everybody who got something to say, anybody who got something to say about some extra weird shit that they done saw or, saw or have evidence of that they just now saying because some shit done said, been said to them. It's like, nigga, why you holding it the whole time? If you, either you go, it's that's just weird. Either you, I don't, all this, I want to air it out. Cause now, he, oh, now I don't fuck with you. Now I'm going to air it out. I don't understand that. I please, somebody help me understand. Help me. For sleeping on me, it's time to creep inside the dreams. I'm Freddy Cougar, the king. Leukemia can't even stop me, boy. I'm probably the goat. Just wait till the numbers match. Just wait till I make it blow. No beef with these other rappers. This it's actually entertainment unless they come with that flame. Till I put them out with that. Yeah, I, I kind of didn't want to listen to him. <clears throat> Respectfully. Any other time, see if I had heard him on his own song, maybe I'd have been like, yo, who's this? But, you want a whole nother nigga diss track. I don't see just because of that. I can't even listen to the young nigga. I don't even know who that is. I don't even respect that. I never liked when people get on people's diss tracks. I never. I'm going to keep it a buck. I didn't like it when um 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 Kendrick just did that because he used his platform as a feature on a future song to say all that shit. But. Who's to say that future don't feel that same way? Cause obviously he let him see it's his mixtape. It's his album. He let him do it. So obviously he'll give a fuck and probably feel the same way. So, but so again, Hey, niggas do what they want to do, but I just find certain shit weird, but who am I? But the owner of my label, see, we don't do that weird shit at W O Y. We ain't got time for no beef. Uh, yo, quick story time real quick. Y'all story time. Um, and Colbert go, he's, he's going to laugh when he see this, <laughs> but, um, a certain rapper in the city of Buffalo, his manager hit me up when I was on my way back from, um, Atlanta one time, um, uh, Colbert and Joe Santi had a show down there. So, uh, actually I think it was me and Joe Santi. We, we came back up to New York and on my way back to New York, I get a phone call from a certain rapper's manager basically asking to get asking permission to let cobra man and his artists get into a rap beef like a fake rap beef and then for like a couple songs and then like come together at a, at the end of it and do a song together yo when i say i flame this nigga <laughs> respectfully i respectfully declined and i explained why but i definitely flame this nigga like no, we don't, we not doing that. And here's why, <laughs> nigga, because no, who does, see, see, <laughs> that right there, if I wasn't paying attention in life prior to that day, that day showed me the difference between men, between males, I should say. There's men, and then there's the rest of these niggas. <laughs> Like there's men who gonna live their life, do what they want, and just keep it a buck, and and do their best to be themselves every single day without compromising whatever their morals are. And then there's niggas who do whatever it take to succeed, <laughs> to win. They don't care how they look, none of that shit. That's not us. We we get rid of that. We over here. We on the <laughs> straight and narrow, nigga. Fake rat beef, really a fake rat beef. <laughs> Just to drum up some uh, some buzz. Yo, y'all niggas will do anything other than marketing. <laughs> yeah.
Y'all niggas will do anything to avoid marketing your music and your brand. <laughs> this shit is crazy. Oh man. Keep a poly on me if you wanna strike back. You know it's OVO season and we bout that. Wow. We finna bop, 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 bam, let's slide. That it? That can't be it, cause this a whole lot of song left. Like two minutes left. Oh, there you go. Beat switch. The beat switch. Sick just pull the future. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Nigga, you ain't slick. Kendrick, first of all, you just pulled a future in Metro Boomin'. You just did a whole song at the end of the song or middle or whatever you would call it. Swish it up, brought a whole nother beat in, and then did a, started a whole nother song, basically, on the same song. Nigga, Future been doing that for years, bro. Future and Metro been doing that for years. Don't start dissing the niggas and then using their own ways or how they done got money to diss them. Like, nigga, that's whack. Nigga, that's whack. <laughs> Don't diss the nigga and they, they do some shit like the nigga. Yo, that's goofy as fuck. I need a shotty for this perfect and spread out. Oh, Give man. me a buck shot, bitch, I'm going out, hun. Give me a buck shot, bitch, Come I'm on, going man. out, hun. Yo, got an itchy, itchy trigger finger. I need a shotty for this perfect and spread out. Okay, okay, I spoke too soon. He did that on purpose. The whole song, that whole, this whole part right now is based off of how Future does his songs. Okay, and Metro does his songs, which I don't know understand why they come in at Future, but again, he allowed the disc to go on his album, so he's in the line of fire. He gets smoked too, I guess. So it's what it is. Um, but yeah, the the beat, the the eight oh eight, how the beat is made, his, the flow he doing on or not, the whole shit is yeah, that's future and metro. Okay. It's a it's a shot. It's a shot at them for sure. Yeah. My makeup sick, I'm obligated to bring confrontation on the greatest bitch. Tell him ah ha your lyrics color fit. All that shit that you was woofing, now your dog's getting the fix. Tell him ah ha we climbing up the dump rounds or something, picking up the pump action with them bird shots going out, hunt nigga bone. Shots fired, no top five, no big three, no big two. This K dot on the big juice is your may back like bone. This part two, this real life, not a Shoot your made back all right boom no. <laughs> oh, shit. He, he 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 talking some shit he talking some shit y'all i don't know cartoon i'm the harpoon get parfait these dark days bringing dark news you run us over your comments up i'm the only go to one coming up been done too long i'm charging up i'm the only one cutting army up in the army up getting everybody you ain't riding with us till we catch your body you hiding from us like you're so afraid that you had to hit us with you from the brave said what yeah got it mm. trigger finger I he, he, he said, I thought, I thought you had them hitters with you. I thought they, where they at? Where they, they coming to Compton? I know they ain't coming to Compton. <laughs> they not going to Compton. We can all, we can all agree. <laughs> they not going to Compton for no beef, bro. We can all agree they not going to Compton for no beef, bro. Drake, Drizzy, the six respectfully um even his peeps in uh houston and stuff because uh, i know his dad uh is from houston no, they're not <laughs> no. <laughs> no let me know what y'all think um okay let me know what y'all think uh leave a comment um who got it right now who who went harder who do y'all believe that drake was getting smacked by diddy <laughs> That is fucking hilarious and just terrible all at the same time. Uh, don't forget, get your tickets now uh, for the Day Summit Music Festival. It's actually April 21st through the 28th, I believe it is. And um, 
it's uh it's gonna be in New York, New York, uh Brooklyn to be exact. And um yeah, get your tickets now. Day Summit Music Festival. Uh Cobra Man will be performing in Brooklyn. It's gonna be lit. Um shout out to Day Summit, shout out to more uh more life booking. Uh shout out to Brooklyn. Buffalo will be in the building. Be out here. Peace. <laughs>